Welcome back to a little bit of Common Crazy. Today I'm going to take you on a shop with me to the Target dollar spot and of course I have a haul. So I was a little bit disappointed in the dollar spot. I really was hoping to find more things. So I'm curious, is it just my dollar spot or does yours kind of look like this too? I would love to know your thoughts on it if you've been to your Target, so leave that for me in the comments below. If you're new to my channel, welcome. My name is Jennifer and I would love for you to stay and subscribe and to give this video a big thumbs up. And don't forget to go ahead and click that notification bell so you know every single time that I upload a video. First, I'm gonna take you on the shop with me and I'll show you around everything that they have. Some things I already picked up, some things I actually need to go back and get because they do have some pretty good things for some stocking stuffers that I have my eye on and I probably should grab them before they're gone. So I do have plans to go back, but let's go ahead and walk through it and then I'll let you see exactly what I picked up. Thank you. 
said, there wasn't a ton of stuff. What they do have, I like it, but I'm not as over the moon as I am with some other things. But I'm really curious if Target is putting out more things and I just haven't seen everything yet. I know in their Christmas area, they were putting some more things out. So I'm wondering if my dollar spot just doesn't have everything in that either. But let me go ahead and show you the things that I did pick up. In a Dollar Tree haul, I showed a pack of stickers. Well, I went ahead and I grabbed a pack of stickers from Target. This is actually a better deal than getting them from the Dollar Tree. I also let you know in that video what I use with these, and I will go ahead and link that video up here so you can check that out. But just to give you a quick overview, I do not put tags on my children's or my husband's gifts. I put stickers on them and everyone gets a different sticker and it changes year to year. So someone might be assigned snowmen, someone else could be Santa, someone else could be gingerbread men. They don't know what their sticker is until they open up their first gift. So this is just something really fun that we started a few years back, a fun little tradition that I like to carry on. So I love these stickers, so I had to pick them up. The next thing I grabbed was this pack of three little chalkboards. So you do get three and they're a dollar each. What I plan on doing with these is using them instead of tags for teacher gifts. I think it'd be really cute to write and chalk the to and the from on there. I just think that'll be really cute. Plus you can do other things with them. These definitely are a must for me. It won't probably surprise you that I had to grab some greenery from the taller spot. This is one of my favorite places to get anything like this. So I grabbed this mini flocked wreath. I think it's really cute and just real simple. They also have several of these make it your own in different shapes and I grabbed the one that's shaped like an ornament. So this next one I've already taken out of its package. It's just a little wood ornament with naughty and nice. So we do have an elf that comes to our house after Thanksgiving and stays until Christmas Eve. And I thought it would be a good idea if he was able to let the children know what his report would be to Santa Claus at night. And so all he has to do is flip the ornament depending on their behavior for the day. Hopefully we can encourage more nice than naughty. That is the hope. Wish me luck. Fingers are crossed. Yes. So the last item that I grabbed is not from the dollar spot, but I still thought it was super cute. And it's just this little snowflake ornament. It was $3. What I like about it is that it is that soft texture to it where a lot of times snowflakes are plastic and hard. And I definitely have a project plan for this, which is why I only grabbed one of these. If you wanna see some DIYs that I am gonna be creating with some of the things that I have picked up, I will have a video for you tomorrow. So make sure that you come back and check that out. Otherwise, I would love for you to give this video a big thumbs up. Make sure that you hit that subscribe button and I'll catch you in the next one. Bye.